This is my 2013 uh, custom built barbecue smoking gun that I just completed. I'm over here at my house and uh, as you can tell I got a stainless smoker on my back porch as well as a stainless steel tables. There's a, another grill I built out of a 12 inch pipe. I'm pretty interested in smokers and been, been making quite a few of them. Um, here we go. I'm going to run it down for you. This is a military shell I've got with a acetylene bottle cap on it to simulate one of the bullets that would actually go in the gun. All the bottle caps are oxygen bottle caps for heads of bullets. It's a six inch pipe recessed in there with a quarter inch plate on the outside of the cylinder. It's uh, fully welded. The barrel's an eight inch pipe. I've got a front sight on it and I've even put a cap on it to simulate an actual gun barrel. The uh, trigger is a piece of six inch pipe stripped out. The ring is off the bottom of the cylinder for the trigger guard. I've got a valve right here for the drain on the main cylinder because you're going to build up and accumulate some grease in there. All right, the firebox back here, you've got a real nice latch. The barrel is a 12 gauge double barrel for the handle. You open that, you get to see the uh, grating, which as you can see, I've already had a fire in this unit and, and burned it out and checked it as well as temperature control. The bottom grate sucks all the way out and you can dump all your ashes out wherever you want to back the trailer up that as well as that grate is completely removable as you can tell the uh, hammer we're gonna get into in a minute with the beer can I've got a jack on the back corner to completely stabilize the trailer um, no matter what position you're in you can level everything up I've got a box back here which I thought would be a really good idea for putting wood in so you can feel the smoker. I've got a real nice butcher block countertop here that it's really really strong and secure and uh, gets me to the door. I've got a step I welded on the trailer itself. It's got safety chains, a wheel jack and uh, the step makes it real convenient for getting on and off the trailer. I've got expanded metal where you're walking. A uh, temperature gauge. Three springs on top, two inside. This is an AK-47 barrel off of Yugo. Had a bad bore, so I used it as a handle. Uh, one finger. I can pick up the door and latch it. I've got two racks in here with stops built in. In the very back on the inside, you'll see the damper. Right now it's in the locked position, which I've indicated with a mark right here. You'll push it to the open position. It's open at a quarter cock right now. As you increase the handle, you can raise the door to whatever position you'd like, and the latch will stay at whatever position that you put it at. When the handle is all the way down and then slid into the forward position, it completely latches the door and the door is sealed. There's our drain at the bottom. And I make provisions for an extra rack if you might need one. The rack slide all the way in. They are completely removable once you reach the end of the the end of the line like again one finger because the door is spring because the door is spring loaded it'll stay in most positions where you can access the rack without going all the way to the rear got a really good seal on the door because uh, I was able to strip it out in multiple pieces and weld it out the uh, grand finale right here I'm going to try to do it with a camera in my hand. I've got an empty can and I've got a hammer set up. So the can goes in the hammer set up. I'm going to get to the side where I'm going to get shot. But you'll stand up here on your grating and grab a hold of the hammer, pull it all the way back, let it go. And I left drainage lines on either side of the the mount so that it could drain and uh, you've got a beer can crusher which is pretty awesome and it makes some perfectly smashed beer cans as well as some really awesome barbecue so there you go complete rundown of the smoker brand new boat trailer that it's mounted on and uh, really awesome I hope you enjoy it